These are the most viewed NFL TikToks of all time. Let's see if it lives up to the hype. Oh my God, starting with the Texans, Deshaun Watson highlight. Dude, Deshaun might be back, bro. He's been kind of balling with the Browns. His first year with the Browns was not good, but she started out this season strong. <laughs> so then Jamal Adams just rocks the mascot. Really wanted that, boom. Dude, you know him and the mascot talked about that, but that mascot was not ready for that hit. He thought it was going to be a lot softer than that. Ooh. Little Patrick Mahomes meat slurping session. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, hey, hey. hey. When you beat the Patriots, is it Christian Wilkins? Dude, is this like, are these old? I'm seeing all these old TikTok trends. I guess it's the most viewed right, ever. That doesn't this necessarily mean it's recent. Right now, you're the best in the game. I know. Wow. Wow. You know what's funny? D-Hop ended up becoming an Arizona Cardinal. This is when D-Hop was on the Texans. He ended up becoming an Arizona Cardinal. He didn't do a damn thing on the Arizona huh. Cardinals. You're the best but in the game. he did become one. I know. <laughs> said, I know. The dude right there said, hey, man, I was going to tell you. You're the best receiver in the game. I said, I know. <laughs> Honestly, that's kind of that's kind of rude, right? I mean, the guy just gave him a compliment, and he's going over to his team and laughing about how the guy gave him a compliment. I don't know. That just seems kind of disrespectful. During training camp, Juju helped with a gender reveal. I can't believe I haven't seen this. Oh my God, it's Steelers Juju. What? Dude, he went from Steelers to Chiefs, won the Super Bowl. Now he's on the Patriots. Oh, it's a boy. Thank God. Thank God. Lucky. That could have been so bad. Dude, the fact that this is Lamar is so crazy. It's so crazy that I never knew that that was Lamar. What? Back in 2013, Pat Mahomes tweeted, I bet it feels amazing to be the quarterback who says, I'm going to Disney World after winning the Super Bowl. Hashtag QBs. Do you guys remember the old ages of social media when you just hashtag shit at the end of like your post for no fucking reason? Nobody even knew why we were doing it. We just go like hashtag relatable, hashtag I'm gay. You know, like, and you don't even know why you're doing it. You're just doing it. I put hashtag I'm gay on about every single one of my tweets. He said he's going to Disney World. He actually went. Nicholas was down on the ground after the play. Ooh. The emotional music. This is a really old school TikTok. Get up, Nick. Get up, Bosa. Get up, baby. He was fine the whole time. POV, you don't have tickets, so you go with plan B. Dude, how do they find these guys who do this shit? The skydive into the fucking arena? Mile High Stadium, baby. You know that guy just smoked the fattest bowl and then jumped out that plane. The person who sent you this. Oh my God, that's Stefan Diggs on the Vikings. Shit happens so fast. God damn it. The league changes so fast. DeAndre Hopkins, gay. Tom is gay. Quavo, kind of gay. Drew Brees, gay. Michael is gay. Snoop Dogg, a savage. What the fuck was that? What the fuck was that? DeAndre Hopkins, gay. Tom Brady, gay. Quavo, kind of gay. Drew Brees, gay. Michael Thomas is gay. Snoop Dogg, a savage. What the fuck? Dude, what did I just watch? I gotta Hopkins, see it one gay. More time. Tom Brady, gay. Quavo, kind of gay. Drew Brees, gay. Michael Thomas, gay. Snoop Dogg, a savage. That's literally the best thing I've ever seen, bro. To get it. You about to get it right there. You about to get this. Dude, the no, NFL loves Christian that. Wilkins. They I'm love Mike and this dude up. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, don't do nothing because you ain't. <laughs> Was that Byron Jones, like, world record broad jump? It's actually insane. Me. After a long 50-year wait, we finally won the Super Bowl. Uh, we were a resilient team. Coming down from... Uh, this is back when people use these dog shit robot voices. These voices aren't getting any better, but goddamn. Double-digit deficits in all three of our playoff wins. It's like, are you too lazy to do a voiceover with your own voice? Or are you, like, scared of people shitting on you? Like, wh what's the deal with this? I never we got it. We had a parade in downtown Kansas City, and even though it was cold, Chiefs Kingdom showed out once again, proving... I can't. I can't. I can't watch that shit. I can't watch it. your balance... I just say what Aww. No way you're Aww. Who is this? Who is this? Who is this player? I have no idea who that is. 
Kind of looks like a running back. It's very wholesome, though. That's cute. Deshaun Watson. Come on, Matt. Make the joke. No, Do the joke, God. Matt. It's so funny. Like, look at how much the NFL used to just... The NFL used to just meat ride the shit out of Deshaun Watson. Because he came out of college. He was so good. And he was really good on the Texans with D-Hop. And then um, you get a couple massages and nobody likes you anymore. Crazy. I remember everybody drafted in front of me. <laughs> Was he really drafted sixth overall? Why would you ever tweet about people drafted in front of you as a safety? When was the last time a safety was taken first anyway? Of course there were five people drafted in front of you. So my dad did the Coca-Cola catch at halftime and won. Wait. Wait, what? That's it? That's all you have to do is catch a fucking... What? That's all you have to do? Oh, you have to catch it multiple times? It's actually pretty cool. I was talking my shit, but it was actually pretty cool. And it's harder than it looks, dude. I was... I did a video where I was fielding those, like, fielding max velocity punts. Holy shit. I caught probably, like, five for ten, maybe. Yeah, so I am talking shit for no reason. This guy's a savage. Look at him track that shit. That's a nasty catch, Loki. Marshawn Lodge scored his first touchdown. They showered the field with Skittles. It's actually messed up. They probably spent so long cleaning that field. First half, Logan Ryan dropped an easy interception. Okay. Yes, he did. Later with the game, he redeemed himself. Oh my God. Wait, wasn't that Tom Brady's final throw as a Patriot? I'm here to tell you right now, we don't care. Let me tell, right, let me tell you, <laughs> we don't care. Philip Lindsay wasn't invited to the NFL Combine, wasn't drafted, signed with the Broncos as a UDFA, made the team, became the starting back, rushed for a thousand yards, made Pro Bowl history, and then was never seen ever again, actually. Like, where the hell is Philip Lindsay right now? Hey. Hey. What kind of fucking wizardry witchcraft instrument is this man playing on? What is this thing? It's like, it's like Hogwarts NFL. This is the theme song for the fucking Quidditch World Championships. And Black Harry Potter's winning that shit. Dude, the, all these, all these old TikToks are just meat riding. I'm not like, I'll meat ride every once in a while, but it's so funny how many like audio sync meat riding TikToks there are. Probably uh, when he comes in, uh, in the huddle and he sounds like a frog. That's probably my favorite moment. I crack up every time, just like it's the first time. <laughs> you want to hear it? Oh no. Oh no. Do it, do it right. Do it right. Uh... <laughs> yeah, Kermit the Frog sounds just like that. I, I can't do that no more. Dude, how have I never seen this clip before? Vernon Davis' grandfather who raised him passed away today. Brought him to tears after emotional 48 yard touchdown. Vernon Davis is so fucking good. That's awesome. Paranormal activity house check. Paranormal activity. What? Have you never heard of wind? Have you never heard of wind? This is one of the most viewed NFL TikToks of all time. The wind knocking a fucking pile. Are you such a casual that you're under the impression a pylon cannot be knocked over by wind? What? Out the back, 10 yards out of bounds. Kronk got a huge penalty for and this. I remember when this him. happened. You came off the field and we're doing this. <laughs> like, he's been talking to me this whole game. He still looks desire. pissed. Yes, he was just yapping to me the whole time, and uh, that's why I took him and threw him out of the club. Uh, the <laughs> so, you know, when you were the yapping, bouncer? That was the bouncer. I picked him up, <laughs> tossed him out of the club on that one touchdown. <laughs> the answer was, I'm here, oh, so I won't God. get bombed. I'm here, so I won't get bombed. Oh, I'm here, so God. I won't get 50,000. It is so funny that he got less of a fine for the middle finger than Marshawn Lynch got. You'd think the middle finger would get you a big 20,000 over a dollar? 100,000 for drinking vitamin water? 
ten thousand for wearing short socks. I don't know. I can I really believe that based off the of TikTok without any context? I think context is very important. Oh man, the hat did not do it again. What did he just throw? I done came in here with my brothers. This is intense here. This is an intense matchup. <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck? Hey, it's actually quite creative. I like that a lot. It's very creative. Go, go, go. Who is that? Is that Naheem Hines? He had a really good um, specialist season that year. What happened to my screen? Was this the year that the turkey was so dry? All right, y'all. Those are the most viewed NFL Tic Tacs of all time. They're actually pretty good. Dude, the one, the one with the kid. That was my favorite. All right, boys. Hey, I love y'all. Thanks for watching as always. I'll see you guys next video. Peace.